Terre Haute's finances return to center stage of another city council meeting. The mayor hopes the council will pass a pair of loans to help with cash flow. News since John Swanner talked with the mayor and a city councilman to see if both men are on the same page. Mayor Duke Bennett has requested tax anticipation warrants of up to $5 million in the past. However, this year's request is for $4 million. Also, for the last two years, the administration has pooled cash from all city accounts. He's asking for $6 million from redevelopment, which must now be approved by the council. This year won't be any different than the last two years. We just have to have a document in place now to show the state that you're doing that. And then you have to show that at the end of the year that all that money was in the pool. The loan from redevelopment must be paid back by year's end. City Councilman Earl Elliott is the Finance Committee Chairman. He says the financial bleeding has stopped and says he's comfortable with the loans. As long as they have uh, funds available to do all the projects they need to do and pay for in 2017. In other words, I do not want this to slow down the growth and development of our community. Bennett says redevelopment's cash balance is $10 million, meaning the general fund will pull from reserves, not putting redevelopment projects in jeopardy. So why are the loans necessary? Bennett once again points to cash flow, especially to months prior to tax settlements from the county. We're not spending as much as we used to, but we have no reserves because of the tax caps. And so we're going to begin to build reserves once we get the general fund deficit taken care of. In Terre Haute with photojournalist Tony Cassasia, I'm John Swanner, News 10.